So tell me if he hasn't gone completely crazy. Have you heard of the Courage to Serve Act yet that they're trying to pass? What this is, is migrants can now be expedited for citizenship if they serve in the military. So they can join the military, say for instance, a Chinese national. Not only they, uh, the Chinese own uh, farmland, all throughout the United States, right next uh, to our military bases. But now, we are going to also expedite their citizenship if they join our military. So, our military now is full of LGBTQ stuff and, and transgender stuff and the general support this and it's gone ballistic, it's gone crazy, we get it, and nobody wants to join the military, especially not under this administration. Let me tell a little story. I came here legally. I went through high school. Straight from high school, I joined the military, United States Marine Corps. After I left the Marine Corps, I was not a citizen. They didn't expect that anything. And I joined while I was a green card holder. I served, I was honorably discharged, and I had to apply like everybody else for my citizenship. So you have the largest influx of illegal immigrants in the history of this country, and Chinese national illegal immigration has increased by 4,000%. For instance, in 2021, it was only 450 of them that came through. Uh, 2023 was 20,000 and now the border is mostly filled with Chinese and Middle Eastern by the way in case you don't know you cannot just leave China you can't just leave you have to apply you have to it has to be a reason why you leave the government doesn't just let you out of the country unless it's for business and stuff like that they don't. That's one thing. Second thing is super expensive to get out of that country. Yeah, that's a long trip. So what they do is they fly to Ecuador. In Ecuador, they don't need a visa to come through. Then they do the little walk and come through the border. And now they can join, if this goes through, of course, our military. Now we have military age Chinese and military age Middle Eastern coming right through that border. And we are just sitting here uh, sucking our thumbs. Why was it that Gavin Newsom rolled out that red carpet for Chi when he went up there to California? Clean the entire city for him. What is he trying to prove that he's doing a good job? I'll go further. A Chinese illegal immigrant just got appointed in San Francisco for the Elections Commission. She can't even vote. Now legally, um, she is probably trying to rush his people through before Trump takes office. So they're just rushing right through. I love it that you all call it fear mongering or whatever. You can be blinded if you want to. You can act stupid if you want. It is serious already. We are getting fully invaded from all flanks. A ton of terrorists coming right through that border. I'll say a ton of terrorists. You've seen the videos of the guy saying, you are about to know my name, coming right through the border, and he so happened to be a huge terrorist. Oh no, but they're here just for um, a better life and footsteps, right? We're losing this country quick, but um, we need to vote these people out of here, and uh, we need to be louder. Uh, we need to volunteer in whatever fashions we can. Uh, it's so out of control right now. That's all I have to say.